Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for coming. Uh, what a lovely setting this is. So really, I'd like to begin by thanking our hosts. I know this is traditionally done right at the end, but I'm going to get it in first. So thank you very much to Stephen for masterminding it, to Andrew, to Julian, and to Mark Lancaster, who's not actually here, but uh, he, he, he has helped in all of this as well. And of course, thank you to you for all turning up and for showing an interest in hubs. Now, this is a really very exciting time for, for us. Um, hubs used to be the heads of the <coughs> University of Biological Sciences, and it has now been reversioned as the heads of University Biosciences. But the acronym remains the same, so there's no problems about uh, trying to remember it. Um, what's exciting now is the fact that we have become a special interest group of the Society of Biology. This is a very exciting time for us, and I hope a little bit for the society as well, um, because it, it really opens up a whole set of new opportunities for all of us. What does Hubs do? Well, we are obviously the organization for heads of departments in universities that teach biosciences, but we're not just for the heads, we're for subject leads. We're for growing the new generation of heads. So we are very much more inclusive than just a bunch of sort of ivy-crusted heads of department. The way we are going to be going about this is that there are basically two strands to what we're going to be doing. The first is that we are now in a position under the aegis of the Society of Biology to have very much more a direct say in formulating national policy. This is what you were talking about. And we are certainly aware that this is one of the fundamental things that we've got to be doing. We are the experts for the subject. If not us, then who? We can advise, we can offer our expertise and help, and we can safeguard <coughs> our subject area, which is important to all of us, I think. So the policy is a very important strand to what Hubs is going to be doing. And the other thing is that we will be, as I mentioned before, supporting each other and the new generation of people coming along behind us. What we're hoping to do is to offer mentorship, to offer development. We're in discussions at the moment with the Leadership Foundation to see if they can, uh, if we can work together to offer sort of hubs type training for um, the, the up and coming people and for ourselves. We all need CPD, we all need a shoulder to cry on or somebody to shout at from time to time. And this is one of the things that one of the roles that hubs can play. So this is a very exciting time. If you're not already a member of hubs, I would urge you to join. And in your delegate packs, you will see that there is, is information about how to join. And in fact, I believe Eva's not going to let anybody out the door until <laughs> <laughs> so um, Also in the delegate packs, you will find uh, information from our very kind sponsors who have helped us uh, to, to Ford coming here tonight. We are a not-for-profit organization, so um, we try to keep fees low and we rely on sponsorship, so please do read the stuff in the packs from the sponsors. <laughs> That's the little bit of puff over with. Um, as I said, an exciting time to be uh, involved with heads of university biosciences. Mm -hmm. We look forward to working with ourselves, with each other. We also would like to work more closely with other interest groups of the Society of Biology, with other member organizations. I think there are some representatives from some of the other societies, um, mini societies, if that's not a politically incorrect way of referring to the puzzle. Uh, and of course, with the executive of the Society of Biology. We are an outward facing organization. We would like to, to make our voice as representative as possible of the whole of UK biosciences. And so we rely on you to do that. If there's something you would like us to do, please tell us. We're already um, starting a register of external examiners. Um, we're surveying the expertise of all of us in the room and each other and other people who are not here. We're starting a, a website, which is an open educational resource, which is going to house a very great deal of information relating to practical science, research-led teaching, and many other things that uh, certainly I as a hub will find very interesting, and I hope you will too. 